Anne Hathaway was the wife of the famous Elizabethan playwright and poet William Shakespeare. She was born around 1555 and grew up in Warwickshire, England. We don't know much about Anne herself, but we do know that, in November of 1582, Anne married William Shakespeare. Anne was already pregnant with their child when they married, and she and Shakespeare would end up having two daughters and a son. The couple's family and friends had to sign a surety of £40, a huge amount of money in the Elizabethan era. Some historians think that Shakespeare had almost married a woman named Anne Waitley, but was forced to marry Anne Hathaway by the Hathaway family. It's uncertain if a woman named Anne Waitley ever existed, though. Anne was eight years older than her husband, which was quite a large age difference. The marriage was probably an unhappy one, and Shakespeare went to London to start his career in theatre. We don't know if their marriage was unhappy or not, though. Shakespeare spent a lot of time in London and might have been unfaithful to Anne while there, but Shakespeare supported his family well and visited them often. Whatever sort of marriage they may have had, Anne and Shakespeare had three children. Their first child was Susanna, and then twins, Hamnet and Judith. Hamnet died at the age of 11, and his death probably inspired Shakespeare to write the play Hamlet. Susanna married John Hall, a doctor. Their daughter, Elizabeth, was Anne and Shakespeare's last living descendant. Anne and Shakespeare's other daughter, Judith, married a tavern owner named Thomas Quiney. Anne ended up outliving Shakespeare by seven years and died on August 6th, 1623, at the age of around 67.